Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of World Conquer 3 mod, the biggest map mod by the Baidu community. So last time we took half of Russia, yeah, we clear out the Balkans, we are moving toward the Spanish Peninsula and also we landed at the British Empire or we can say the British Isles. Okay, so I hope that this is gonna be the final episode or maybe this is gonna be the second or maybe the, the, the third one will be the last uh, because Yeah, as you all know, there's a lot of stuff we need to fix right now like there's a lot of troops Yeah, we still have this guy at the Maldives, so it's gonna take quite long uh, in order to pass all of this uh, Maybe you guys should vote for a poll whether or not we should finish Russia or we should be stopped or maybe we should conquer the world yeah so let's just play the game okay so looks like we have already uh, ended our turn last time so this time we're gonna end oh wait we still have one more submarine to go okay nice 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 the damage is too great I love it uh, so today is was it this yeah Saturday yeah nothing to do quite busy had a lot of work lately uh, but I still manage time to record some stuff or else I will be starving for the next 24 sorry not 24 for the next 30 days uh, since the Logan Paul situation you know happened uh, not very much youtuber earns a lot like back in December I earned good enough for myself to eat for myself just for myself but uh, since you know, Logan Paul thing happened, you know, all those, especially those small uh, YouTubers uh, complain that they earn nothing at all. Uh, even another YouTuber, which is uh, Zero Style, uh, I talked with him last night, he said that he he, he he knew, he knew that what is already happened, so he, he opened a Twitch account uh, so that people can donate anything to him, uh, which is good, I believe. Uh, Twitch is a good platform. Uh, I've seen a lot of people got you know donation, one dollar, two dollar, five dollars. That's that's enough. Okay, it doesn't matter how much is it as long as it's worth it. Uh, people can do it. So we took Norway. We still have one more city to go here. Norway and also Russia. Oh, oh, we still got one more here. Uh, maybe I can paratroops. Maybe I just change my direction. I got this one. Okay, nice. Let's just go this way. Uh, yeah, sorry for the noise, you guys should know, right? My neighbor is just annoying as fuck. But luckily, I will change my house uh, by the end of December this year because it's right now it's being built. Yeah, you might have known that. Uh, you guys can okay. Uh, okay, so we are now at Moscow. I'm gonna take down Moscow. It's, I believe, it's quite a long journey uh, from, from here to. Asia like so I, but I believe it's gonna be quite fast I don't know but just see it uh, for now focus on the Russian Empire oh no not the Russian Empire so we you know, I always confuse this stuff when it talks yeah uh, take up this one okay look we got one our army lost already Munchstein, okay, we're okay. We're not quite good, but I will take that. Okay, gonna land my artillery barrage. Uh, we're gonna need that at the sea and the shore. We have Greece right now. We haven't landed in Africa yet. So I'm gonna change my direction. Okay, gonna build a cruiser. And Rommel, you're coming here. So still one more city, I believe. No. So why didn't they capitulate it? Oh, we, we still have to go out this way. Ah, shit. Never mind. Oh, uh, yeah, I, I forgot about United Kingdom. Nice, 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 nice. Yes. Okay, another artillery. Okay. 
Okay, so yeah, we can paratroops, I believe. Nice. Okay, one more. Uh, no, uh, not paratroop this time. Gonna be strategic bombing. Okay. Very nice. Another one. I love the way they make the, you know, the, the air bombing. It's great, to be honest. This is great, you know. Uh, sometimes you have to rely on uh, air power too. You don't just focus on the damage of the mainland troops. Because if it's just that way, then the game will be nothing. And I just figured out the system of uh, World Conqueror 4, the air power. Uh, you have to upgrade to the max and you will see the result how, how great the power is. The, you know the, the air power by the troops. Okay, so they just spawn another cruiser here. So my goal is to make sure that we took this. We take this. Uh, we going to take the one here, and we're gonna move to the Ural Mountain. Yeah, this is a Ural Mountain. I love the way they made it look so cool. And we also got this stuff here too. So right now I'm gonna finish this guy at percussion. Uh, British and turn. I'm gonna take Russia. Our priority is Russia, Soviet Union, or we can call it right. Sometimes I, I just confuse between them. I know that they are communists, they are monarchy, they are democrat or whatever. Uh, but sometimes I, I just mix up the words. Uh, sometimes I call it Soviet Russia. Sometimes I call it Soviet Union. Sometimes I call I call it uh, USSR. Yeah, it's just mixed up together. So. Okay, so we took Moscow. Gonna move on to another one. We can turn back, I believe, this guy. Okay. Take out this cruiser. That's what we wanted it to do. We need. Oh, I forgot this guy. Gonna X some space. Okay. Coming down, coming down, much time. Okay, so Manstein. Okay. Uh, for those who don't know, Manstein uh, parents died so young, and he had to live with his uncle and their parents. Uh, his sorry, his his family. Uh, most of them are military, so that's why Manstein had the military blood inside him. Like, you know, try to inherit their family tradition of being a general. And he also served in the World War One uh, as the elite, like elite troops of uh, King Wilhelm II, I believe. They yeah, the king of uh, the, the king of German German Empire. Yeah, that's that the backstory. Uh, for me, uh, I believe that yeah, much man is a good general. Honest, but sadly he was framed as a Nazi so his fame as a greatest general uh, might not give him much credit unlike Rommel. For Rommel uh, he faced a lot of allied troops and the allied troops knew his capability so his fame will be forever uh, you know people will, be, will always remember his name if you say the desert frog people will know who the fuck is desert frog so yeah that's that's the different uh, because Manstein he never fought against the ally I believe he fought against the Soviet Union but allies like American the British France yeah he fought against France uh, at the Baltic battle of uh, Maginot line I believe uh, but you know still no you know what you know the French they are not quite you know memorizing that stupid uh, French people they always like that you know they're just different different species I don't understand sometimes. Uh, yeah. So I'm gonna land in Africa soon. Uh, I'm gonna try to take. It looks like the British they just vaporize everything. I mean, come on, look at this horrifying graphic they did. And all of it desert. So I'm gonna try to take this percussion. Uh, I don't have another general. Oh, I got this boy. I got Guderian and Joseph Stalin and Eisenhower. Okay, so level 3, I believe. No, we don't have any level 3 factory beside.
uh, uh, Berlin, I believe. Okay, I feel bad for that. Uh, yeah. There we go. Uh, and I will post it uh, a video hack about Bull on this video. People a lot ask me a lot. I mean, come on. Uh, I know people might know, some people might not, so I guess this tutorial will help. But maybe we we'll try to bombard some. Oh, nice. Okay. Oh, that's great. But we, we need a lot of points. Okay, enter. Where, where was I? What was we talking about a moment ago? We talk about Manstein. We talk about. Yeah we, yeah, we talk about Manstein. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, he, you know, like, they they bias, so only Rommel will be, uh, you know, remember. Because even in the Man in High Castle, if you guys watch that movie, uh, uh, story, uh, it's, a, it's a drama, I believe, a historical drama. They even mention Manstein as the desert frog in the beginning of the story. So that means that, yeah, they, they admire Manstein, uh, not Manstein, uh, Rommel. But yeah, they admire Rommel, that Rommel is the, you know, greatest German general at that time, blah blah blah. Yeah, you know how they bias on each other. It's sad. And also, Guderian, Guderian, he's also did a great job in the West of, uh, yeah, Eastern Front against the Soviet. Uh, yeah, and other general like uh, Heinrich Himmler, he, he's a douchebag, you know, he didn't do anything at all, just a douchebag. We we'll always take credit for what other did. Okay. Sorry for the noise. You might hear it again. Just some you know, some stuff. You know, living in this country is not easy to me. You know, people. Some people they don't really respect other people at all. Uh, especially when it comes to law. Uh, they might say, "Oh, we just we are a developing country. We we are not advanced, so we still have some mistake." I mean, come on. It's already 30 years get over it and try to be civilized and be professional because this is the way people do if you are not trying to be uh, like you know if you just if you just make mistake and not correct it then it's gonna be forever it's gonna be the same so it's better for people to you know, uh, fix their mistakes like the neighbor knows. Uh, I don't really mind them but sometimes it's, it's just too much so Okay, so back to our front and you have to revert. Okay, number one. Okay, so our artillery is good. Rocket artillery. You guys should know uh, there were many general of World War Two that were excluded from. Uh, easy tech will conquer four because of the not not the license but the Nazi stuff. Uh, I, it might shock all you. you. You guys might ask. So so why Hermann Göring was featured in World Congress three? Yeah, there were many generals that were featured in World Congress three. A lot of them. A lot of them. Even they are committed a lot of crime. But it's like you know they, I don't know. They they just fucked up. I mean come on. I don't really understand. And they even they didn't even edit the Chinese Sino -Jap Japanese war uh, war you know the, the Japanese war against China yeah they didn't even add it as a campaign I still don't get the idea uh, in World War Two China did a lot of job I mean come on uh, give credit to China don't just fuck them up like that uh, China did a lot of stuff uh, fighting against Japan if Japan uh, control China or annex China, Soviet Union will be in a huge problem. That's that's the big deal. To be honest, it's gonna be a big deal. But they didn't see it. You know, they just meh. They don't really care. So give credit to China. That's why they are a superpower right now. Everything is made in China. Some some of you might say, oh, if it's China product, then it's not good. No, uh, people try to. Uh, you need to understand that. Uh, it's, I think I believe it, it becoming into a business topic or economic. Uh, 
you can see that China is a communist country. Yeah, uh, most Westerners believe that oh, communists will fall soon or sooner or later they will fall. But no, no, they they will not fall. I'm trying to take out this one part already. Uh, the reason why they are not fall because when it comes to production of the Western ideologies, uh, they tend to try to compete or we can say outsourcing uh, between the production so they will try to find the best place with the best price to produce their greatest product so China uh, or we can say other communist country or a developing country uh, they're gonna focus on that pay a good amount of money so that they will accept the price of outsourcing the product so it's, gonna, it's quite I know it's, it's kind of annoying as I'm talking about business right now but try to understand why China became the largest economic country uh, in the world like they like it is they, they always say that China is like a sleeping tiger yeah they are sleeping just don't wake them up okay like Japan they wake Japan Japan wake China up so now they knew who the hell is China don't mess with China they are like the big boss to be honest so okay I just clear up this one and, and then they came again no. I know this is gonna be taking forever. I think that's enough or not because we clear out Moscow. So I don't know, guys. Uh, we had a good talk, by the way. Uh, we took all of Russia. Uh, yeah. So what for the poll? Whether we should continue or not. So this is gonna be the end of the second episode of the greatest map map. So I hope you guys enjoyed this one. And sorry if I had some mistake talking. I just woke up. It's Saturday morning. Uh, I had a uh, you know big night last night. Like a lot of work uh, in my job and some other stuff. And try to figure out why the fuck YouTube cut us up. <laughs> okay, so that's it. See you guys later in the next episode.